Namaste. My name is Rui Zimra. I'm International Meditation Master. Today I want to speak about Bodhidharma encounter with Emperor Xiuxan or Wu. And this is one of the greatest wisdom what I have learned. So I speak slowly. Emperor Wu, how much karmic merit have I earned for ordaining Buddhist monks, building monasteries, having sutras copied and commissioning Buddha images? <laughs> Bodhidharma, none. <laughs> Good deeds done with worldly intent bring good karma, but no merit. This means merit after passing by. Even in one interpretation of Bodhidharma encounter with Emperor uh, um, Xiuxan or Wu, Wu asked, will I get mukti <laughs> for my deeds? <laughs> Building temples helping monks. <laughs> this is a joke. No? Bodhidharma, what? You mukti? <laughs> You will burn in the seventh hell. <laughs> okay. What Bodhidharma means, you will never get anything when you die for your wealthy activities. Again, you will never get anything when you die for your worldly activities. Okay. According to the Buddhist way of life, there are seven layers of the mind. Instead of just doing what is needed, if a man does something and then keeps accounts of it, I have done it. How much I have done for somebody, he is in the lowest level of the mind and he will invitably suffer because he is expecting people to be nice to him in return for his deeds. All this I, 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 I is only suffering. No? Okay. If they are not nice to him, he will be mentally tortured and it will be the seventh hell. Okay. If you want something, okay, then do it. And if you do something for other people and you want a return for that, you're just like a dealer, just like a trader, but not a guy who gives out of his heart something. Okay, for the marketplace, it is good, but for life, I see this again and again, how greedy the rich people are and they don't give anything. The poor people are more generous, other in the average, but much, much more generous than any rich people. No? Okay, because they know how to give out of the heart. Okay, and that, so we need to contemplate and to meditate to find peace in the mind. And that peace, what we have found, we get also afterward when we pass by. For materialistic people, contemplation is nonsense and so my whole life. But the reality is it brings you so much in this life and also afterwards. Okay. Thank you that I could motivate you. Meditate, meditate, meditate. Bye.